breaking news, just awful. A man we've learned mauled to death by dogs over in the Channel View area. We first brought you this story as breaking news at 4.30. Since then, ABC 13's Erica Simons learned new info from deputies there along Garling and Sheldon. Erica, good morning. Good morning, Jacob. You said the perfect word, awful. This is a very busy road, Sheldon Road, as people come and go to the ship channel, come and go to work. And so last night about 1 a.m., or this morning rather, that's when a passersby found a man across the street behind us, as you said, at the corner of Sheldon and Agarling. He was laying in the road. The Harris County Sheriff's Office is working this death investigation. And right now, they believe the man died after being attacked by a dog or dogs. It took a while for the medical examiner to come pick the body up. We were here on scene before that happened. So really just awful all the way around. That man, we're told, is a Hispanic man in his 30s or 40s. He has not been identified yet. And tech detectives are working on getting some surveillance video, trying to figure out what exactly happened, but the man was near a bike. They believe possibly he started out on the bike and somehow got down on the ground. We just got a briefing from a Harris County Sheriff's Office. Here's what detectives had to say. No, we do not know where dogs came from. Well, I say dog or dogs, so we don't know. We don't know if it's multiple. No, we don't. We had no witness to the uh, dog attack, just the uh, puncture marks from being bit. This area is known for having lots of dogs. Uh, I haven't seen any recent reports, but it is known to have stray dogs in the area. The man had multiple bite marks on his body. It really was a brutal attack. And this area, like I said, is very busy. They described it as being commercial. So even as we were here in the early morning hours, people were driving by, stopping, looking at the scene. So the next step, obviously, is to figure out exact cause of death and then, of course, notify next of kin. We'll stay on top of it and bring you the latest. For now, we're live in Channel View. Erica Simon, ABC 13 Eyewitness News. All right, Erica, thanks so much for that live report. You know, to go along with that, ABC 13 recently investigated dangerous dogs. Uh, we can tell you that as you take a look last month in Fort Bend County, a 71 year old was mauled to death by a pack of seven pit bulls. The next night, a 16 year old refugee from Egypt named Omar was hit and killed by a car in a leaf while running away from a dog. And then two days later, a Houston police officer was bit in the leg while responding to a vicious dog call. Now we looked at county records which show most attacks were reported on the northwest side. You can look at these reports inside mm -hmm. our website, abc13.com.